continuing our unit study on kites and we're going to find out, we're going to calculate the wind speed because we need to know the wind speed in order to fly kite. Now you want a wind speed around 4 to 12 miles per hour, that's good wind speed. If it's too much more, then it's not safe to fly. And if it's less, then it's not going to go up. So, what we need to do is we need to have it miles per hour, and we need to use conversion and convert them. Okay, and so we're going to use this. What is this? Who knows? And and yes, say it loud. Anameter? Anameter. Anameter. So what we're going to do is we color one cup that has a different color. Orange. Yep, we're going to use our fan. We're going to turn on, turn on a, what is it called? High speed? No, no. We're going to use high speed, but we're going to use a timer, and we're going to turn it on for one minute. We're going to do it four times, and we're going to get the average of it, and then we're going to solve and see... How, how fast this, this right here, this fan is, okay? How many miles per hour? So let's get going. <laughs> so Jasmine joined us today. Yes, Hi, Jasmine. Hi, Jasmine. She joined us today. Here you go, baby. And so we tried our anemometer. How do you say? Anemometer. And we got how many revol revolutions? How many times did it go around? Um, the first one. One minute. No. First one 66 and the second time it went um, 69. So we're going to say 67. Okay, so we're going to add 67 right there. So first we need to solve is the circumference. Cir circumference, okay? So we need to find the diameter. So what I need you to do is, where's the ruler? Oh, there it is. So we need a ruler, and we need our anemometer, and what you're going to do is the back of this cup and the back of this cup, or any of the cups, you are going to measure it in inches, and you're going to tell me how much it is. Inches? In inches. Okay, like this. How many, how much feet does it take to make a um, um, Five. What? Five. Five. Okay. So, Is it like, um, do you mean like um, this? Touching this, kind of like this and this? Yes. Yep. Five. Five. Right. And so, and then we're going to multiply Five. it by 3.14. Okay. So, what's 3.14 times five? Um, and that will be first 20. Okay. Then it would be 7. Okay. And then that would be easy because it will be 15. Okay. And two, put one right underneath there. So these are unit of equations. So one foot is 12 inches. It's the same thing. So here you can switch it up around and you can put 12 inches by one foot or one foot by 12 inches. So we have. 15.7 inches by 1. Esther, what are you going to add next? What? What are you going to do next? Using these. Okay. Um. Good. Yes. So you're going to cross it out? Yes. So what do you do next? Do you multiply, divide? You divide. <laughs> okay. So Peter, you're going to divide that for us. Go ahead. By what? 15.7 by 12. Okay, write the answer next. Oh, Peter. No, no, I still write the answer. You write the answer. Times 12? Divide it. That's one dot three zero eight three 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 three. Okay, but one point what? It's one point three 
Zero. That's it. Eight. Okay, okay. Three. Oh, so what we're going to round it up to? Three. 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 Okay, what are we rounding it to? Coffee. <laughs> what are Six. we going to round it to? What One, is that going to be? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, we don't need this. Okay. <laughs> so it's going to be 1.31, 1. okay? That's what we're going to use, okay? And so what is it going to be? What's the units? Hmm? What's the units? Oh, like help these two? Inches or foot? Um. What's the unit? You crossed out something. What did you cross out? I crossed out the inches. So, are you going to use inches again? No, we can't. No. So what's going to be the unit? Foot. Foot. Okay, good. Okay. So, so that is going to be 1.31 feet. So what do you think we're going to use next? We need it to be miles per hour. So we need miles on top and hour on the bottom. What are we going to do next, Peter? Um, Look, please. How, what are we adding to it? So, okay, we're going to find out how much feet does it travel per hour, actually. Oh, so we can actually change. So we have this. So what we're going to do is... So you want me to times this by 67? <gasps> no, hold on a second. We're going to do this. We're going to do 65, 7 revolutions. Oops. Sixty-seven revolutions by Five. one minute. So what is that going to be? We're going to multiply it. Yep. Yeah. Make it short. I only need like two, three numbers. Uh, it's eighty-seven six five eight. Is there a point? Yes, there's a point. After eighty-seven. The eighty-seven. One? Eighty-seven. What? Point six. Five, eight. Okay, that's it. And then there's seven stories after that. That's it. Okay. So, okay, you get it? so Wait. Eight last time. this is going to be feet per minute. Okay, we're getting closer. Times 60. Okay. Right? So, what are we doing next? Times 60 per minute. Okay, where are we going to put the okay. minutes? Top or bottom? <coughs> Top. Yep. So 60 minutes times Clear. one hour. Six. So eight. cross out the minutes. That okay. equals five two two five nine dot five. Say again. Five two five nine dot five. Five two five nine. Five two five nine. Where's the dot? Dot five. Like this? Just one five. Like this? Yeah. Okay. And so what are what is it what is it gonna be right here? Uh huh. It's gonna be feet. What's the units? Feet yeah. per hour. Mm -hmm. Okay? So we're getting closer, right? Because we have the hour, so we don't wanna move this. We don't wanna change it. How many feet next to hour? Is the other one that we need. In one mile, there is five thousand. 280 feet. We need that conversion in order to solve this problem. So, 500? 5,000. 5,100. Okay. So, 5,280. Okay. So, where do we put the feet? You know, this is almost the entire mile. Okay, how much? Where do I put the feet? The feet? Uh, over there. On the bottom, right? So 5,200 and did I say, oh, 80. Why do I keep doing it wrong? And 80 feet. And what's right here? One mile. So at the end, we're going to have miles. We're going to have hours. Is that correct? Miles per hour, that's what we need. So you're going to divide these two numbers. And we're going to find out how fast our speed is, miles per hour. How much wind? Can we fly a kite or not with that weight? So, do I? No. Can you divide it? It would be one mile per hour. Is that what I'm saying? Less than one hour. Look. 
This was under that number. Uh -huh. okay, okay, well check it out. So you think it's gonna be less than one mile? It's tw it's twenty one feet under a mile. It's oh, almost okay. Mile. Well, tell me exact. Exact. Mhm. Mm okay, do the calculation. Tell me exact. Hi, Charles. Divide this. Some more equations, just random ones, and seeing what we actually need. 